Hello again, and greetings from inside Kamikaze 2014. I am the Green Hornet with my martial arts expert always, Kato, here with me. And uh, we're here with Yaya Han, very elite cosplayer. She's looking fantastic today. Yaya, tell us a little bit about your cosplay. Hi, everybody. I am actually dressed up as my superhero alter ego, so I'm kind of cosplaying myself. This is Yaya Han from the um, comic book Wondrous, if, which I am collaborating with, uh, with Lionforge Comics. So it just came out, the first issue came out in uh, October, and uh, we are going to have more issues coming out. And it really is a superhero adventure that, uh, you know, will involve conventions and cosplay and it's awesome. Awesome. Well, we're looking forward to seeing that when it comes out. Obviously, you're very talented, and, and you inspired them to create this new idea. That's great. Franklin, what do you think? I think it's great. I mean, all the times that we've seen Yaya throughout the years, especially today, I mean, it, it never grows old. And I really appreciate your time, Yaya. Thank oh, you so much. You know, Yaya, I want to, first of all, before going any further, what do you think of our costumes? You guys look very legit. You guys look like you stepped off from the movies, TV shows. I mean, just jumped off the screen. Great. Very we, cool. And we appreciate that. And back to you, uh, how about like you, a future project? We know you just finished up like the, the Heroes of Cosplay. I mean, what else is going on? I have a lot of things going on that I can't talk about yet. Okay. <laughs> but, Your contract. Uh, okay. Yeah, I mean, the, the year is coming to an end, which is usually where I take time to develop certain projects and um, also go back into designing. And, you know, I've definitely had ideas for next year uh, for not only my costumes, but also my company and, you know, so it's like, business. yeah, yeah, the tail end of the year is always uh, sort of a time for reflection and regrouping and starting to work behind the scenes, you know, instead of traveling every weekend. Well, well you, of course, you're always busy. You're going constantly going to conventions. And what's the, what's the next convention for you after this? Well, I have maybe another event coming up in New York. Um, and actually, then that's it for me for the year because I specifically want to take off um, a couple of months from traveling so that I can sort of, you know, get all of these things going for 2015. So I know for a fact um, the next convention I'll be at in um, 2015 is KatsuCon. So I super look forward to going back there. It's one of my favorites. And where is that? It's in Maryland, yeah. Washington, D.C. area. Okay. And how about Los Angeles area for all the fans around here? I think I will hopefully be back for um, San Diego Comic Con, Anime Expo. I have a booth there. Uh, so, But whether or not I will be there is not certain yet. Mm -hmm. So um, aside from that, I don't really come to L.A as much as I'd like, which is why I'm so happy to come back to Komikaze. So. Yes. It's always nice to see you. We remember seeing you at Long Beach. Remember that, remember that uh, boss? Yeah, that was the last time uh, and I met Yaya uh, for the first time there. We were in costume, Kato and the Green Hornet. So uh, we just really appreciate your time, Yaya. You look great today, and we're looking forward to seeing you in the future. And for now, we'll just sign off. Talk to you guys later. And Desiree, Yaya wants to give you a quick shout out knowing that tomorrow it's her birthday. Desiree, happy birthday. I hope you're going to have an amazing week. And hopefully I'll see you at a convention soon. We love you guys. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.